Indira Ma'am was born in Kakinada on 22nd August in the year 1965 to the couple DL and Murthy Garu and Varalakshmi Garu and having a sibling Anuradha Garu. Three generations of Ma'am's maternal family have been ardent devotees of Swami. They have had the privilege of close proximity to Swami. Ma'am was blessed by Swami and got Pada Namaskar when she was six months old baby. Actually, she was placed at Swami's feet. Not only this, Swami also visited her grandparents' home in Kakinada. These incidents only prove that she was indeed the chosen one. Indira Ma'am's father, Murthy Garu, who was an employee of Indian Oil Corporation Refinery and retired as a deputy manager, had an opportunity to take his children to different parts of India. So our ma'am had her pre-primary studies in Baroni school which was run by the refinery. She continued her schooling till 9th class at St. Xavier's school in Haldia in Kolkata. Ma'am was also an active athlete during her younger days. She was a very talented throwball and hockey player in Haldia. Later on, she completed her matriculation at Andhra University in Vaisag. Thereafter, Swami blessed her with an opportunity to complete her 11th and 12th at the Anantapur campus. After her high schooling, she moved on to Baroda and completed her graduation in B.Sc. Home Science at Maharaja Sayaji Rao University. She also did a diploma in preschool education from the same university in Baroda. Thereafter, she got married to Gadepalli Aditya Nagaprasad Garu, who was senior section officer in accounts department in railways in the year 1990 on March 15th and came to Rajmendri on May 21st. She was blessed with two sons, Shivakarthik and Srinath. Currently, Shivakarthik works as assistant manager in transworld of group of companies in Dubai. And Srinath has completed his MS in chemical engineering in Canada. She had appeared for an interview at Sri Satyasai Gurukulam on May 31st, 1990. Had an orientation program and the journey in Sri Satyasai Gurukulam started on June 7, 1990 and rendered her services as first class teacher for 30 years and served the institute for 33 years, two and a half months. During her course of service in the institute, she also suffered two fractures, but that didn't stop her doing what she loved the most. Swami continued to be by her side and helped her stay strong all along. She won over the hearts of hundreds of children who had come to live in this residential setup, leaving behind their parents at quite a tender age. She was like their second mother, as many of those children still fondly remember her. She is much more than a teacher. She is one woman who could trust blindly and discuss whatsoever we want with her. There is no doubt in saying that she is the epitome of a perfect human being. Thousands of students were chiseled in her hands who went on to have successful careers as doctors, engineers, managers, CEOs and so on. She is the kid amongst the kids and an elder amongst the elders. Having someone like her was no less than a blessing. She is one who always believes and finds pleasure in giving and helping others without expecting anything in return. She is a colleague, leader, educator, great friend, guide, a visionary, a mentor. We will miss working alongside you in the staff room and we will miss your big bright smile even more. 
Thank you for being there for us all these years, ma'am. You have had such a long and successful career. You have been great to work with, and we will never forget all you taught us along the way. Your teamwork and dedication are greatly appreciated. We can't imagine walking into the staff room and not seeing your face. Thank you for every single second you have spent with us. It is truly appreciated. Having a wonderful person like you as our colleague has been a gift. We hope retirement brings you the chance to do whatever it is that you always wanted to do but did not get to. Wishing you the best of health, happiness and success in the next phase and your new journey in your life. We hope you enjoy your retired life as much as we enjoyed working with you. Good luck in retirement. We are all going to really miss you ma'am. Jai Sai Ram.